What's up, Homo Power Ice Crew? Today's video, we are taking out seat belts from a Jeep Cherokee XJ. Let's get it. Now, taking out the seat belts are several bolts that uses the T50 Torx. Let's take them first. So, back here in the back, we got this one and that one on both sides, of course. <clears throat> Now, where these ends attached down there, I've already taken those out, so they're also the T50 Torx. But I'll insert the video here where I did it. But what am I going to cut it with? I'll cut it with that right there. Four and a half inch angle grinder with the Linux Metal Max blades. These things rock. Super tough. They don't explode like those abrasive blades do. And they cut very, very well. So I'm going to get right underneath that right there, cut that head of the bolt right on off. like that on the driver's side and passenger side t50 torch here and t50 torch down here but to get to that one you got to take off all that trim right there which consists of screws that are along right there right there right there right there and you got one back here obviously i've already broken it loose Now we go up top and take that one out and it's done what this side is. Now on the rears after you get this T50 out right here, 10 millimeter, take it out. Now just in case your 10 millimeters are missing like they normally are, I'll put a link down below where you can order some more 10 millimeters and the T50 torques for that matter. And just like the T50, there's a 10 millimeter on each side, but I'm sure you've seen that by now. So anyway, yeah, take them out if you need to, whatever you need to. But once you get that 10 millimeter out, we gotta pull the seat belt on through. So what we need to do is make it a little easier if you go ahead and pull that bolt on out. Your plastics here, push that tab in, right there, right there, and unhook that. Feed that through like this. Then you take this, kind of bunch it up a little bit. Well, let's separate that back out like this. Feed that through first, then feed that one through. Pull it all through. Plastic's out of the way. Pull this, feed that down, feed that down. out just a word of caution if you plan on keeping them don't just throw it down yeah that was junk not trash them anyway now as for the front seats they're attached right here and there are t47 torques on those now this cherokee has been built into a camper so i'm just kind of disassembling everything so i'll link up the video to where i took out the front seats and you can see exactly how those come out cool cool the only reason I'm saving the front seat belt stuff is I probably put it in rust bucket. But to be honest with you, I'm probably just going to spring for a five-point harness. Uh, also, I've got a 14 bolt and a Dana 44 GM of a uh, K20 Chevy going on to rust bucket pretty soon. So everyone, if you're enjoying the teardown, thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't. Leave some cool comments down below. Peace. Later, y'all.